Hello everyone. In this video, I'll be playing some exhibition matches in WWE All-Stars. So WWE All-Stars is an arcade wrestling game that was released back in 2011. And this game features really high impact, action packed moves and the gameplay is really fun still to this day. So I have posted some videos on this game in the last few days so I posted a match between Hulk Hogan and Shawn Michaels and as well as a triple threat match between three giants Big Show, Mark Henry and Andre the Giant. So in this video as I said I'll be playing some exhibition matches and as always don't forget to leave a like and leave a comment. I would like to hear your thoughts on the game if you ever played this before and would you like to see more of it on this channel so I will just start the first match of this video so I will go with the extreme rules one on one to start things off so I will be choosing Rey Mysterio and I'm going to go against to go against a giant superstar like the Big Show. We can just do it in the Monday Night Raw arena. So the presentation, the graphics of the game still look really good to this day. And most importantly, importantly So you can see the match is about to start and this should be a really fun one. So the high flies and giants are really fun classes to play in this game. You can see Big Show dominating. So I still have to get used to the controls as they are a bit uh, as they are a lot different than 2K22's controls. So I'm not still not used to playing this game yet. I used to play this a lot before but it has been some time since I played it regularly. You can see Big Show just manhandling Rey Mysterio there. I'll just use my high flying moves to pick up the pace. So Big Show just Big Show skull just went crashing on that uh, steel post, and we can grab this ring bell. Oh, so just Big Show just grabbed it. And you can see this cool high flying move there. That was a nice counter. So I can now finally grab that bell. So 
this has been a challenging match I will have to duck and I get killed by the big shows knockout punch so you can just hit it out of nowhere in this game this was a fun match so we can now do a multi-man match for the second one so maybe we can go with a triple threat elimination So you can see the exaggerated models of Hogan and Cena. We'll do triple threat elimination. So I will be choosing Shawn Michaels for this one. And you can have Randy Orton and Edge. Edge and Randy Orton. You can do this in the uh, WrestleMania Arena. So they created a fictional WrestleMania Arena just for this game. You can see the loading screen. So they have this current generation of superstars Rey Mysterio, Kofi, and Sheamus going against Bret Hart, Ultimate Warrior, and The Rock. So they are the legends. Imagine. Imagine in a new WWE All Stars game with the current roster with Brock Lesnar, uh, Goldberg, that will be so awesome if they release a new All-Stars game. So I know they did release 2K Battlegrounds which was sort of a spiritual successor to this game but it wasn't the graphics, the presentation did not uh, attract me so I haven't played that game. I don't like the, the action figure lo looking models and these models look really cool but in uh, 2k battlegrounds the models look really tiny so i'm not too uh, not a big fan of that art style so edge is a uh, grappler so he can chain together different moves so that's his ability while I think Randy Orton is a brawler so I think he has a super punch or something so I just grabbed a steel chair oh, and I think yeah disqualification is on so they just give me a warning yeah. this isn't this isn't extreme rules so we can use weapons good thing that they gave us a warning before getting us disqualified So Shawn Michaels is a high flyer just like Rey Mysterio so you can use those moves. So both Randy and Edge went crashing. Oh, and that was a nice counter by Randy Orton. Big Springboard DDT. I'll try to eliminate both of them at the same time with the switch in music. So I'll try to set that set that set that as a goal. That will be a cool finish to this match. Edge went outside the ring with that Irish whip and Orton about to go for his signature backbreaker. Oh, and 
I just got eliminated. Uh, I was just about to get eliminated there. But it's too difficult to escape the pin in this game. So it says all human players have been eliminated from the match. Yeah. I think we can go with another multi man match. So I'll do another triple threat match. This time I'll do extreme rules instead. Okay, so we'll go with Extreme Rules Triple Threat Match as the third match of the video. So I will go with uh, I'll go over with that uh, with Macho Man Randy Savage in this one. Uh, we can have uh, the Ultimate Warrior, Warrior and the Undertaker. We can do this in the All Stars Arena. Well, I, I hope you guys are enjoying this video. I plan on doing more commentary videos on different wrestling games on the newer wrestling games as well as the older ones so if you have any suggestions on which games you would like to see me play just let me know in the comment section below Nice springboard DDT there. And that was a nice reversal to that leg drop. Macho Man about to go for a signature move. Macho Man has the elbow drop as his finishing move. Oh, I just missed it. Well, that was a brutal chair shot. And Ultimate Warrior with a suicide dive. I just hit the elbow drop on Warrior. And five star frog splash.
and take a went for the armbar. So this is in elimination. They are just trying to make the pin. And Undertaker about to go for the last ride. And you can see each map move has uh, each move has an impact. I just escaped that choke slam. Oh, and I was just about to go for the elbow drop. So why isn't he breaking the pin? So the AI is sometimes really stupid. Uh, so he didn't broke the pin. So I lost the match. So we can do a one-on-one -on -one match, I think, uh, again. So we can do extreme rules one-on-one -on -one again. So this time we can go with with Edge, Edge and John Cena. at uh, SummerSlam. So I really like the SummerSlam Arena in this game. Elijah going for the power bomb and went for the DDT. So that was a nice combination. As I said before, Edge is a grappler so he can chain together different moves. And now I'm getting, getting the hang of the controls. Edge with the execution, the signature move. I think he's about to go for the electric chair.
I see I went crashing down. Going for the execution again a second time. So Lita has pressed from the top rope. So I went for the armbar so many times. So the ending was a bit lackluster. I wanted to finish the match with the spear. So guys, we can play another match to end the, before ending this video. So I will be going with a with a steel cage match. I think we can do Kane. Kane versus. We can do Kane versus Mark Henry. Guys, if you have any match requests you would like to see from this game or any other wrestling game, uh, you can feel free to let me know in the comment section below. So I might be doing a live stream on this game soon as well. So I also did a poll on uh, which is your favorite SmackDown vs. Raw game. So, so far most people voted for SmackDown vs. Raw 07. So I, I've seen that uh, that game I think is the most popular among all the SmackDown vs. Raw games. My personal favorite SmackDown vs. Raw game is 2011 because of the weapon physics. That's my favorite SmackDown vs. Raw game. Two thousand eleven was a really good year for wrestling uh, wrestling games. I think two thousand ten because I think both All Stars and uh, SmackDown vs. Raw twenty eleven got released. This match is between two giants, two powerhouses. Mark Henry was DLC in this game, so fortunately I was able to purchase him before the servers went down. So I wasn't able to purchase Chris Jericho uh, or the Road Warriors. So they can't be they can't be purchased anymore unless you have a modded console. He just threw Kane like That was a nice reversal. About to go for the signature move. 
Uh, I think this is a power bomb of some sort. Kane about to go for the choke slam. Kane's model really looks good in this game. So I'll just try to escape the steel cage. It's some sort of mini game there. I'll try to escape again. Also, the mini game is a bit tough. Again, goes for a high risk maneuver. And this is a second signature move. So that was a nice combination. You just manhandled Mark Henry. Oh, that was a big knockout punch. I also try to escape the cage at the same time. You can have a sort of a fight upon the cage. I'll try not to let him escape. And Mark Henry just went crashing. They both went for the high flying move, but Mark Henry was successful. You can even see the AI having some trouble escaping the cage. go for the choke slam again second time it was a really fun match and challenging match as well okay so I'll just try to escape but the mini game mini game is hard so I still haven't been able to be successful once Mark Henry might win this. Oh, he's really close. Oh, and he wins the steel cage match. This was a really fun steel cage match. I hope you all enjoyed this video. So let me know your feedback in the comment section below if you would like to see more videos like this with commentary for different wrestling games. So I'll be ending this video on this note. Hope everyone enjoyed. And thank you for watching. See you in the next video.